In this video we will talk about nightmares. Nightmares are dreams that are scary or disturbing. The themes of nightmares vary widely from person to person, but common themes include being chased, falling, or feeling lost or trapped. Nightmares can cause you to feel various emotions. Here are 10 steps could help you ease your nightmares and improve your sleep and quality of life. 1. Establish a sleep routine. Nightmares occur during rapid eye movement sleep, the phase during which our muscles relax and we dream. Waking up during REM sleep enables recollection of the dream and resulting distress. One of the most effective ways to treat nightmare problems in adults is actually to get them sleeping more soundly, so, they wake up less often. A healthy sleep routine begets sound sleep. Develop one by exercising, setting regular sleep and waking times, ensuring your room is dark and cool, avoiding stimulating beverages after mid-afternoon and engaging in relaxing activities. 2. Cut back on alcohol. Alcoholic beverages can induce restlessness and awakenings throughout the night, potentially helping you remember nightmares. A lot of people use alcohol as a way to wind down and feel sleepy at the end of the day, but it's really not the right solution. Instead, try herbal teas and other beverages conducive to sleep. If drinking was the only part of your relaxation routine, chat with your partner or read instead. One drink more than three hours before bedtime is okay. Just pay attention to whether it causes a post-dinner nap and alertness at bedtime, and eliminate that drink if it does. 3. Don't eat before bed. Snacking can boost metabolism, which causes your brain to be more active and could lead to nightmares, according to the National Sleep Foundation. While some people sleep better after eating a light snack, you should stop eating 2 to 3 hours before bedtime. If you notice that you have nightmares afterward, try avoiding nighttime snacking or heavier meals before bed. 4. Review your medications. Some medications can prompt nightmares by interrupting REM sleep. If people can identify that their nightmares either started or increased when they had a change in their medication, that's definitely a reason to talk to their doctor about their medication schedule or alternatives. Melatonin, while a popular sleep aid, influences our circadian rhythm that regulates REM sleep, and can lead to more or fewer nightmares. If you want to take melatonin for better sleep, work with a sleep specialist to ensure you're taking it at the right time and not compounding the problem. 5. Practice stress relieving activities. Nightmares activate the sympathetic nervous system, the fight or flight system, the body's natural response to imminent danger. The body also has an innate relaxation system, the parasympathetic nervous system, aka the rest and digest system. Progressive muscle relaxation and other relaxation activities can help activate that system. 6. Journal your worries. Write down your worries to get them all out ahead of time, lest they rear their disquieting heads at night. Journaling can be helpful for alleviating nightmares and stress in general. 7. Don't watch or read scary content before bed. Since our nighttime observations can appear during sleep, spend some energy engaging with things that are more emotionally neutral or even positive before bedtime. Reading the news media and then hopping into bed is more likely to trigger disturbing and upsetting dreams than looking through pictures from your last vacation with your family. 8. Rewrite the ending. Imagery rehearsal therapy is effective when the chronic nightmares are showing similar themes and patterns. Since nightmares can be learned behavior for the brain, this practice involves writing down in detail the narrative elements of the dream. Then rewrite the dream so that it ends positively. Just before falling asleep, set the intention to re-dream by saying aloud, if or when I have the beginnings of the same bad dream, I will be able to instead have this much better dream with a positive outcome. By practicing a rewrite during the daytime, you increase your chances of having them at night while you're sleeping instead of your nightmare. 9. Use a white noise machine. Silence is key in a sleep routine, but for people who either don't like it to be completely quiet or who are awakened by noises they can't control during the night, background noise is a good strategy. Rye a fan or a white noise machine or app for several consecutive nights to help your brain adapt. 10. Check up on your mental health. If nothing works and you're still having nightmares, talk with a therapist or sleep specialist. Nightmares might be a sign of a larger issue, such as PTSD or a mood disorder. It is possible to treat the nightmares without treating the underlying disorder, but it may also be helpful to treat both the symptom and the disorder. There has been great progress on psychological treatments for nightmares, insomnia, anxiety and mood disorders. Do not be afraid to ask for help. Psychotherapy works and it is often short-term and accessible. Thank you for watching. If you like the video please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.